A nutritional plan and a screening is not only uh, required, for Joint Commission standards that every patient who comes into the facility has a screen, a nutritional status. It's, it's critically important for every patient's recovery. An example that I could tell you is if someone is not able to chew well or has strict habits on gluten or um, maybe lactose intolerant, we need to know that right up front. We do the uh, nutritional screen within 24 hours of when the patient arrives, and we communicate any allergies, any sensitivities, any restrictions. They may even be cultural restrictions or religious re restrictions on what someone might eat. We report that to our culinary staff at each of the facility so that they can provide a good, well-balanced meal for each of the patients. It's critical. If little things might mean a lot, if you're not feeling well and you're in detox and you feel like most of your life is just now basically shattered and you don't know how you're going to put it back together, sometimes a nice meal really makes a difference for the patients. So we hold that in high priority and make sure that the patients are getting what they need. We also don't want to feed someone peanuts, if you will, if they have an allergy that's going to just create one more problem for them, which we want to avoid, of course.